Well, hello everyone again. I have a new review for you. These are three amazing editions in a hardback style from Thomas Nelson. And we have here uh, an NKJV, another NKJV, and one KJV uh, translations. And uh, the reason why I wanted to get these three together is because today in the market, we have plenty of leather soft uh, editions and uh, obviously premium Bibles like uh, soft soft uh, goat skin and uh, calf skin. Now, don't get me wrong, those are excellent editions. Those are uh, high quality and uh, premium Bibles that will last you for years, decades, uh, and you will pass down to your kids. But there is another side of the spectrum which are the classic hardbacks, which means this is cardstock, very hard, and uh, like the old books from old. And uh, uh, this is a different type of Bible for different uh, usage. What do I mean by that is that there are certain things that you can do with this Bible or these Bibles, but that you cannot really do with uh, more floppy and flexible uh, leather covers. Uh, for example, let's say you are on your bed and you want to read the Bible. Well, when you have a hard back like this, the pages of the Bible itself, look, I'm only holding with one hand, your Bible is gonna stand still and flat right in front of you, as you can see here, with no effort that you cannot get with a leather bound or leather lined uh, edition of the same Bible. So there are certain things that these editions actually are far more, uh, uh, let's say, you will get a better experience in using them than the, the, the leather soft or, or leather bound editions because of the nature of it. So, I'm going to show you now the actual uh, editions that we have here. This is a compact edition of the New King James. Okay, it has a very nice uh, grainy uh, gray cover right here. Okay, with NKJB Holy Bible stamped uh, on the cover. And on the back, on the spine, we have a flat spine with the NKJB Holy Bible, NKJB and Thomas Nelson logo right here. Very simple, very classy. This is a hand size, this hand size edition. As you can see, my hands are not too big. And you can feel this Bible is not heavy at all, very portable. Easy to put in a handbag or something like this. Very good, and it's not heavy at all. Now, the edges are white, as, as most hard, hardbacks will actually uh, come. And you got one and two ribbons one red and one gray as you can see here 10 millimeter thick they are nice and uh, they are quite long I like them the 
the cover itself is pretty cool. Now we have a nice pattern here in grey color and right on front of you you're gonna get the presentation page with Psalm 119, 105 your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. I think very classy there. Looks very cool. Holy Bible. This, table con this is the table of contents. Preface. have one introduction page to the Old Testament and we've got the book of Genesis right here now they are very very nice looking typesetting we got here uh, what is called the comfort print of Thomas Nelson exclusive to them for the NKJB and it's gonna come in black letter with red uh, highlights for chapters, uh, titles, book titles and even on the column where we have the references and full uh, translator's notes also we got the red highlights that are gonna be matching the text and I really like that. This is a one single column in a paragraph format which it makes great for, for a, a reader and this is what I believe these books are meant to uh, uh, just to get your Bible, start reading. As you can see here, this Bible really lays flat. You put it on your table here in Genesis. That's gonna lift up a little bit because it's, it's a new edition, but uh, in no time that can go just like that. As you can see, that Bible is gonna lay flat right there. There's another uh, a great thing about these hard, hardback, hard covers. They're gonna lay flat like that, very nicely. This paper is very cool. Very, very minimal uh, uh, show through or, or ghosting. As you can see right here, I really enjoy this. Uh, I think this Bible is great for um, portable to take on the train, on the bus. Uh, to take with you to work and you are on the canteen or on your break you can take this out and, and just have a, a quick read a couple of chapters um, this paper would take very really well a couple of uh, notes with uh, your micron pens or, or the GTEC uh, special acid free archival ink ones that are out there too um, I'm very happy, I'm very impressed with this, this paper for, for the price and uh, uh, this is a lovely edition. I really like the layout of it. And uh, if we come here to the New Testament, you're gonna see that this is indeed a black letter. So it's basically there's no red letter, letter for the words of uh, Jesus the Messiah, uh, but you still get the red uh, highlights for the chapters and, and and the titles for each paragraph or book so you can see right here and down the back this edition comes with a lovely three column concordance pretty thick you can see here so this is quite a few pages and the concordance is very readable too I mean, I can read perfectly well the, the small letter right here. It's uh, uh, So again, even though this is not meant to be a study Bible, you can really use it for your own devotionals and studies. You, you've got concordance, a great concordance actually, uh, plenty of references and, and uh, the translator's notes. Uh, so I think you can actually use this for any purposes really. And uh, we've got the maps, Tom Thomas Nelson's maps in a thicker paper, uh, plenty of color, kind of glossy paper. Uh, these maps are very, very cool and very readable. I like the, the color and I really enjoy them. And uh, that's the paper back again, liner, 
that closes this edition. Very good, and, and if you can actually uh, put this on your shelves, and it will stand perfectly well in your in your bookshelf. So that is the uh, compact single column New King James by Thomas Nelson, hardback. And let's have a look at these other editions that we got here. This is a different type of uh, cover. This one comes with a kind of denim type of fabric cover in two tone, a gray and a, a dark a yellowish color, which I think is very classy. And on the spine, we got the lettering stamped on a gray color too, NKJB Holy Bible, NKJB logo and Thomas Nelson logo right here. Nothing fancy, straight to the point. Now this one comes with a white thread around the perimeter stitching and uh, a very dark, uh, a very nice and darker uh, NKGB Holy Bible stamped on the cover right here. You can see it's very cool. Now this one is a larger edition uh, than the uh, small compact edition, single column. The interior is the same style, the grey um, paper kind of uh, liner with a presentation page. It's the Holy Bible containing the, the Old and New Testaments. And right here we're gonna have the table of contents. This one is the NKJV Thin Line Reference Bible in large print. It's the, uh, also printed in China. Uh, same month and year as the previous one. This is in January 2018. And the paper is the same. This paper is amazing. I mean, it's not too thin, it's not too thick, it's just the perfect, uh, uh, I'd say, combination for not having a very chunky Bible, yet uh, good quality paper. We've got the preface and the introduction page for the Old Testament. Now, this one has only black leather, but the font is a, uh, is a larger font, as you can see. And this one is a two column, rather than single column, two column, still in paragraph format. And the references are relegated to the bottom of the page, which I really like to, when you want to read, sometimes you don't want the, 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 the references to be in the, in the middle. Sometimes that could be distracting. If you want to study, that could be okay, but if you just want to read, sometimes this is the best way. And uh, I like the fact that also, down here, down the bottom, we got some of the uh, uh, translator notes, but it's not the full set of translator's notes. You have some of them, uh, and it's plenty of references as well, cross-references. But Now, this paper, as I said, is very nice. Uh, it's line-matched, which means that each uh, line on this side is going to match with the line from the other side, which is going to also help you in your reading experience to be uh, much, much uh, joyful. But I have to say, this Bible is not heavy at all. I can carry this anywhere and just hold it with one hand. Look at this. The page is going to lay flat. It's not going to curve. It's not going to bend. And I think this is what hardbacks uh, uh, have advantage over uh, the leather bound, leather lined editions. Now this one in the, in the New Testament is going to have red leather. So it doesn't have the highlights in red, but it does have the words of Jesus in red. And this red is amazing. It's very dark and very consistent throughout the, the New Testament. Anywhere you go, the red is brilliant. I, I really like this, this, this red. You can't go wrong with this one. Very nice. And uh, down the back, this edition also comes with a very, very nice and extensive uh, 
concordance in three columns and the maps again in this uh, glossy thicker paper with vibrant colors and very very sharp printing and I, I like is how readable this is very clear uh, nothing fancy straight to the point hardback books like this are amazing now this one comes with two uh, ribbons one and two in a very nice uh, sil dark gray silver type of uh, color and uh, again this Bible is gonna lay flat there you have it no matter where you go if you go to the beginning of it let me show you even on the presentation page it's gonna lay flat <laughs> so you can't go wrong so this is the uh, thin line large print two column edition hardback by by Thomas Nelson okay in the new King James and here we have another uh, edition of, of Thomas Nelson but in the King James now this one unlike the others do have a bit of a gold gilding right here for Holy Bible this again is kind of cloth overboard and this one is a light gr a green color with a darker green sorry darker gray light green darker gray <laughs> I said it and in the back you have in gold stamping also Holy Bible King KJV for the King James authorized version and the, to the Thomas Nelson logo right here I really like that spine very classy now all these Bibles again are perfect for putting on your uh, book uh, shelf they're gonna stand like this no problem whatsoever I think it's just brilliant now this one has a bit different uh, uh, liner it has a different pattern still gray and classy and some 118 it is actually uh, using the obviously the KJV thy words a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path this is indeed the authorized King James version in red letter edition and this one is the large print thin line too this is the translators to King James uh, letter and uh, it doesn't come with translators to the reader but it's a thin line so they let that out table of contents our page for the New Testament and here we have a brilliant text from the KJV in a verse by verse format but it's plain double column text in a verse by verse there's no references on this one it's just a plain text in two columns verse by verse which I really really like now for some reason this paper seems to me to be thinner than the other paper of the other Bible uh, I think this paper is uh, a bit thinner somehow it has a bit less op opacity I don't know why uh, but it seems to me that this paper is not as as good quality as the other one or from the New King James now it doesn't mean that this paper is bad all I'm saying is if if I have to compare the two I prefer the other one the 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 NKJV paper show you right here I think here we have a bit more of a show through or ghosting than with this one let me find a page where I can actually compare yeah definitely here there's more much more show through than than the NKJV so to me this paper is a bit thinner and it has less opacity than the thin line from the NKJV edition definitely I can guarantee that's that's my what I'm seeing right here don't know if that is actually the case 
but that is what I, my eyes see. Uh, and this one is a red letter, so let's go have a look at, uh, here we go, very nice, I uh, love this red, well done Thomas Nelson, that, that red I love, dark crimson type of red, it's not pinkish, it's not faded away, it's, it's r nice and readable, if the red isn't like this, I prefer not to have it, I just rather have black ink all away but this red doesn't bother my eyes it actually is nice it's nice to look at and down the back let's take a look we have the one year reading plan that we were talking about it doesn't come with concordance there's another difference right there and we have a 30 days sorry let me open this up you there you go 30 days with Jesus okay uh, so you go like 30 different 30 different uh, uh, verses or, or rather verses parts or portions of scripture from the New Testament that are key uh, in terms of getting to know uh, the Lord uh, so I think that's a very nice it's only one page but it's nice to have it there and then we have our maps and a note regarding the type. Again, it's right here. You want to take a look at that, read it. The same maps as before. I really like this. Now, this paper, although it's glossy and it's thick, is not too thick. It doesn't really bother me. Uh, some people prefer that to be in a, a finer paper, uh, but I like this one, I don't mind, it's, I think it's class. And we have here again the paper liner and the grey color. We have here two stamped in gold, the ISBN, and in this case we have two thinner ribbons. I don't know why they didn't use the 10mm, they're using here the 6mm uh, ribbons. Uh, honey gold, two of them, you can see, and uh, that's that. So here we have the differences among these three amazing editions, uh, which I really, really like. Uh, in, if, I w if I was to pick one, I would go for that one. Th this one is my favorite out of the, th out of the three, uh, but you can't go wrong with either, either of them. If you're a KJV user, this one is very nice. And uh, if you are an NKJV user, either of these two, you're going to be happy with them. That one has definitely a larger font. If your eyes are not so good, go for this one. If you have good sight, uh, I don't have a great sight, but this one doesn't really uh, bother me. I mean, I can read this very pretty well. So uh, you, you shouldn't have a problem with any of them. That's all for today. This is my review of these amazing hardbacks uh, by Thomas Nelson. By the way, they sent me these copies in an exchange of a uh, uh, fair review and uh, I'm just uh, telling you what I think about them. No strings attached. Uh, I really think you uh, be happy with them. And again, these are the type of uh, books that you want to have next to you in your bedside locker and uh, have loads of reading from it. I encourage you to do that. This is God's Word. And although these are nice books, what's most important is what's actually inside. Well, thanks for watching and give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't done so yet. Share with others and I'll see you in another Bible review or rebind. Until then, I wish you Shalom.